Hey guys, tomorrow's workout. Let's get through this. Weightlifting, speed squats. So speed endurance, okay? The intent is to move quickly, okay? So you're gonna grab dumbbell, kettlebell, okay? Or backpack, holding in the front rack, okay? Whatever you've got for weight. <clears throat> you're gonna do 10, say 10, squats as fast as you can, going through full range of motion, obviously, okay? 30 second rest after each set, so it's a short rest. We have eight sets of that, so it's 10 reps, 30 second rest, eight times, okay? It's just for speed, the weight doesn't have to be crazy heavy, so if you're coming up out of the bottom slowly, especially on the first four or five sets, Okay, it is too heavy. Okay, I don't think any of us, any of us are gonna run into that problem um, with the equipment that we have. Okay, but that is the first part of the workout. Then, I forgot to write it down. Okay, oh, it, uh, it'll be on the app, <clears throat> so don't worry about it. We're gonna do some uh, rear foot elevated lunges. We're gonna work on some leg strength as much as we can, try to keep our legs strong. Okay, while we're all, uh, we're all working out from home. So. Rear foot elevated. You can put your foot on a bench if you've got one. You can put it um, off the edge of your couch. You can put it on a chair. Okay, whatever you've got to elevate your back foot. Okay, make sure your heel stays on the ground. Ideally, shoelaces down. Okay, on the foot that's on the bench. Knee to the floor. Push up to the heel. Knee, knee tracks in line with the toes. Okay, you guys know the drill. We're gonna do 12 reps on each leg, okay, with a minute rest between each leg. So we're gonna go 12, rest a minute, other leg 12, rest a minute, and we're gonna run through that three times. When we're done that, okay, finally something a little bit shorter for the conditioning. We got a 14 minute AMRAP, alternating dumbbell snatches for 20 reps, 50 double unders, 12 lateral burpees over the dumbbell. So we did those um, on Saturday. Okay, so we won't go over that. The alternating dumbbell snatch. Okay, obviously if you're like me and you live in a, in a condo building, okay, you, you can't smash your dumbbell on the floor. So it'll just be a low hang. Okay, so take your dumbbell. Okay, it'll be just before you touch the ground, snap the hips, extend overhead. Okay, switch arms on the way down or just transition your hands at the bottom. Either is fine. If you got low ceilings, okay, or you're part giant and you can't go overhead, okay, that's fine. Single arm dumbbell swing, okay, just get it as high as you can. Eyesight, shoulder height, whatever you can do, switch hands, shift it up. Okay, if you don't have a dumbbell, you don't have a kettlebell, again, going back to the backpack, okay, you can do a ground to overhead. Okay, so it's just here. This face starts on the floor, clean it to the shoulders, press it overhead. Back to the floor, clean it to the shoulders, press it overhead. Okay, that works great. Put as much weight in, in that as you can, okay, where you can get through 20 reps and a minimum of two sets. Double unders, okay, to scale, it's gonna be one to one for singles. Okay, we want you moving, it's only 14 minutes. Uh, burpees over the dumbbell, obviously, if you can't jump, step, that's fine. Um, ideally, it's a jump, you guys know the drill. So 14 minute AMRAP, Alternating dumbbell snatches, 50 double unders, 12 burpees over the dumbbell. Awesome guys, that's it for tomorrow. Again, we'll be doing some accessory stuff. Um, at the end, um, we'll go over that then for those of you that wanna stick around. Thanks again guys, we'll see you tomorrow.